Praise the Lord. Let's begin with a small song. Righteousness, peace, joy and the Holy Ghost. Righteousness, peace and joy and the Holy Ghost. That's the kingdom of God. Righteousness, the peace, joy and the Holy Ghost. Righteousness, peace and joy and the Holy Ghost. That's the kingdom of God. Don't you want to be a part of the kingdom? Don't you want to be a part of the kingdom? Don't you want to be a part of the kingdom? Come on everybody, don't you want to be a part of the kingdom? Don't you want to be a part of the kingdom? Don't you want to be a part of the kingdom? Come on everybody! Hallelujah! I love to thank God for this lovely opportunity. And also I love to thank Sam for giving this opportunity. Today's word of God I'm going to share about Romans 14, 17. The kingdom of God is not about eating and drinking, but it's all about righteousness, peace and joy in the Holy Ghost. That's what I sang right now. So we have to be more focused about kingdom oriented. We need to have the standard of God which He wants us to walk on this earth. That's why we pray we have our Father in heaven. Hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. So our mind has to be transferred according to the kingdom of God. I like the display which is in our group kingdom builders that's really awesome and also the title for the for our group it says God's workshop or kingdom workshop so our workshop should be more focused about kingdom if you see Matthew 6 33 it says like this seek ye the first kingdom of God and his righteousness if you read Matthew 6 carefully, do not be anxious about what you eat, what you wear. Even Gentiles, they worry about what to eat or what to worry. But you are more special. Yes, once upon a time we were in the kingdom of darkness. God purchased us by His precious blood. And he has called us into kingdom of light so we have to walk as he is walking in this earth so we have to have that mindset that's how the principle works that's how the formula works the kingdom mindset we need to establish on this earth that's why we pray on earth as it is in heaven so we have to be more focused about kingdom mindset if you read Galatians chapter 3 verse 2 set your minds above not on the earthly things for you died and your life is now hidden with Christ in God when Christ who is your life appears then you also will appear with him in glory so now our life is hidden with Christ. We have to walk like Christ on this earth. Then we will be really like the light of the world and salt of this earth. So God may help us every day. Let's pray. Heavenly Father, thank you, Jesus. Lord, help us to build your kingdom. Give us your wisdom, knowledge, and understanding. Holy Spirit, help us to walk in your way and your righteousness, Holy Spirit. Holy Spirit, help us to build your kingdom so that your name be glorified. Let Christ be glorified in each of us. Yes, Jesus, guide us, guard us. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. God bless you. Take care. Bye-bye.